let's move on to predictions with the OK Sphinx. <laughs> Open your third eye and predict the future with the Great Sphinx. Alrighty, time for predictions. So, we all guessed a winner. We all guessed the fastest lap. None of them panned out. Um, Decker and I got pretty close because we each picked a marble that ended up on the podium. So, congratulations to us for that. The nice. other three picked marbles that got a full zero points. I'm pretty sure all of them Let's got go. lapped. That was hilarious. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, that's this... kind of what happens. All all the people who got zero points got lapped. So, so uh, yeah. the standings right now, we have Hector in fifth with six points. Sky in fourth with 12 points. Decker moved up to third with 24 right Ooh. up against Term who's still in second with 25. I have 43, not to flex or anything. I'm doing totally well with flexing. <laughs> this is just depressing <laughs> for me. Yeah. Yeah, see, I preemptively called you the OK Sphinx because I knew you were just going to shit on me this segment. Uh, hey. Also, shout out to Crush. I mean, uh, it, it seems like Decker was very, uh, very true about all of his statements about him. I thought Mar- Marble Cross fifth place. You know that was a good sign for the Turtle Sliders, but it seems like he walked into traffic and just got smushed. Yep. <laughs> well, I, I can tell you guys up here in Canada, there's lots of beware of turtles crossing the road because most of the time it's crush, and you know what happens. Yeah, but then there's sometimes dash, and then oh, it dash ruins always your makes whole it. Car, the the sign know? literally yeah. is a picture of a turtle, and underneath it says crush. Like, you watch out for Crush, because Crush keeps getting crushed. Oh, my God. <laughs> Jesus, Canadians are more dark than I thought. Oh, jeez. Uh, okay. Now, now I got, did you say how many people uh, joined this week? Yeah, Yeah, we had, I, I DM'd this message, the t- term, multiple times. That I 36. Keep forgetting the number. 36. 36 people joined, and we have a Way total to run of, a segment, not a guy. <laughs> Woo! We have a total of 46 <laughs> people in the entire segment, so yeah, keep at it and see how far you move up. Speaking of the fan things, um, Wispy was absurdly popular in the picks today, but only one person got the winner correct, a Reddit user whose username is, I'm assuming, pronounced the Udu Amsu. I don't know how to pronounce that, but congratulations, you picked Smoggy. And hey, congratulations, per- Boo Boo Amsu. <laughs> and one person on Twitter named IB Cool picked Clemen as the fastest lap, so congratulations to you, nice. as well. you as well. Take the three points. I'd be um, cool was the guy that I was saying that we should switch out Tandarin or uh, Mandarin for. Uh, he'd become the orange marble. Oh uh, it was uh, in a past episode. I said he wanted to turn into a marble. That's my guy right there. I love I'd be cool. I still want him on the team. Uh, maybe not by Rango, but get rid of Tandarin for sure. I see. All right. Uh, top five in the fan standings. Fifth place, we have Cyan I picking Crazy Cat's Eyes both times. It's a decent haul. Only person in the top five who did not get there by picking Orange and last time. Uh, fourth place, we have Melanie. Uh, tie for second is me and the Reddit user Chance Geologist 3894. And in first place, after picking Orange and Red Eye, Scott Egger. Good job, 45 points. God Two damn, above Scott me, Egger. I'm coming Let's for go. You. Wow. Nice. Let's keep it up, bud. Let's go, baby. I like that. And that is that is it for predictions. Hopefully for uh, 60% of the show, it'll go better next time. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Uh, I, I am so pumped about Crush. I mean, after Dash last week, I thought this was like the turtle sliders thing, man. I said, Frankie got the boys like in line. This is the one thing that the turtle sliders are good at. Apparently not. Uh, but hey, good luck to Dash next race in uh, Misty Mountain. Uh, but with that, one, thank you, Nautagon. You're the best. And actually, you are a great Sphinx. I was just lying before. Don't uh, make him use you. his Sphinx powers Two, on you. I can hold on to the title a little bit longer. <laughs> All right, so this is enough tomfoolery. Let's get into our predictions. Yes, let us do it. You know the Let's drill already. Oh, are we going to do the drop in here? Whoops. Yeah, we're doing the drop. We always do the goddamn drop. Open your third <laughs> eye. Hey, maybe open out. your fourth eye today because Misty Mountain's already cold. Open your third eye and predict the future with the Great Sphinx. Uh, all right, it's time to, for all of us to pick our predictions. You know the drill. Pick your winner. Pick your fastest lap. 
hope for the best because term is behind me by like 18 points. Let's go. Hector, let's start with you. I mean, first of all, hashtag unsalted clutter is my favorite hashtag we've got so far, and I doubt you're going to be able to top that. Secondly, took natural- probably about 45 minutes to figure that one out. Mm, not surprised. Anyway, my my picks for this one. Honestly, it's hard to say because the helixes might shake things up a lot, but they won't. Fastest lap, I feel like I'm going with clutter. It's a good pick. We have for winner. Uh, for winner, let's go starry. I like them. Okay. I like yeah. that. Yeah. Not Already. really any reasoning behind it. It just feels good. Yeah. yeah. Starry looked good. Oh, yeah. Sorry, looked really and good. And up next, we have Sky. What do you've got? All right. Um, so my fastest lap, I always like generally picking somebody in the mid-pack because I feel like that's where you can get the, uh, the quick laps, get the quick drafts, stuff like that. So I'm actually going to go with Cerulean on this one. Ooh. That big bully. Yeah, that big bully Cerulean. I, I, I mean, he's going to bully guys like like Bella Yola did. And then for my uh, winner, League. I actually think Hazy's going to go back to back. I'm picking Hazy to win it. Ooh. Damn, all right. I like it. Someone cares about okay. Hazer's repeat winning. <laughs> Wait, you said the Hazer, that you said Hazy's going to Hazer's going to go back to back. Didn't Hazy race it last year? Yeah, Hazy Race. Yeah, Hazy yeah. Race. I don't know what you're talking about. I thought you were talking about uh, this Spoggy one. No, 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 no. I mean, that so. would be back to back, too. Uh, to, yeah. to be fair. Yeah, yeah. All right. Next up. That's why, <laughs> that's why I would say Hazers go back to Hazers back. Hazers are going back to back in more ways than one. Wow. Find out how. <laughs> what a move. <laughs> All right. Next up, Decker. Pick for fastest lap and winner. Well, I love Sky's meth- methodology for picking fastest lap that's been my go-to ever since i got into marble sports but i'm gonna go with a different marble give me arab sitting in ninth or tenth place i think right in the middle of the pack should be ninth ninth. i like what arab has been doing this season fast marble i could definitely see a fastest lap out of them and again going with what sky's knowledge here i i love the hazers and i love hazy i chose hazy to win in misty mountain 1.0 and hazy ended up winning it for me so you guys all know me. I love the try, tested, and true. So give me hazy all day long to win the race. Guys, why are you predicting term to get more fantasy points? Because we're good gamblers. Bet hedging. Bet yeah, hedging. We're a gambler. <laughs> good gambler. Good gambler. Good gambler. Good gambler. Decker, I like that you're playing off my uh, playing off my brain. It's a real good gambler yeah. mentality. Yeah. Right, good man. gambler. Good I hope gambler. You win it. Absolutely. All right. Speaking all right. of term, you're next. Um, I I really liked how Shimmer did the uh, helix, and as somebody who's full of double helixes with the DNA, going with Shimmer, great uh, for the win. Uh, oh, they're dropping off a cliff. Lap. I'm sorry, but they're dropping off a mm. cliff. Oh man, yes. oh, they look so good. They looked what? really Shut smooth up. in the helixes. Shut up, Sky. I'm sick of it. I picked them last race. It was a big regret of mine. Yeah, well, you picked the wrong marble because uh, Shimmer's out here. Sorry, now. I picked Glimmer. That's a very yep. fair yeah, point. Yeah, Glimmer stinks. Shimmer's great. Are you a Marbeats fan or not? Jesus Christ! Right, I'm a big uh, Marbeats fan. Fastest lap of go with Origin. I mean, it's the <laughs> fuck. It, it's it's a goddamn redemption tour, man. It's a revenge tour for Origin. Uh, yeah, but- I think we we're, we're gonna get like fourth place, something like that. Ooh. And Hector, you can tell me how badly that aged. Yeah, but, you know, Counts I'm already covering myself on Twitter. We'll be good. I mean, personally, <laughs> I think Origin might climb like five spots, but Clem's the fastest lap marble on your team. Agreed, not a gun. Yeah, yeah, but Origin is the hard carry. No, that's she's prim. The prim. Oh, okay. Okay. prim is the hard no, carry. She's you the made prim. your pick, not a gun. Who right. you got? Let's hear. Uh, my pick, honestly. Um, Term took the words out of my mouth on that one. Shimmer looked really amazing on the Helix, but so sexy. it's Shimmer, so like I think I can go fastest lap. I don't think I could pick Shimmer to win this one. For winner, mm. you know who's on a mission after what happened last time? Cerulean. I would go with Cerulean. That just like makes sense. Oh, true. To that's me. the that that's Cerulean the... looked yeah. 
really Cerulean good in Q1. Arc. Yeah, Cerulean is really strong in this. Really strong in Q1, I think. This guy's a big bully. I, I'm not supporting bullies, dude. <laughs> you see what he did to Mocha today? He, he gave him hot chocolate take a week right on the track, dude. I don't like that. Yeah, he really melted you him. You always hate that kind of stuff, man. That's racing. Get over it. Anyway, tweet at us with hashtag unsalted clutter or comment at me on Reddit if that's where you see it. And, we'll and add if you, you put the, the butter emoji right after that hashtag, we'll like you a lot more. <laughs>